Hi guys! I want to get on and get this is a this is a, a little bit different video. Um, first of all, someone needs their bangs cut. Someone needs their bangs cut. My story. What is my story? What is my story about beauty? Rockstar mom and Palm Spring Cindy did my story. And they, well, they asked, or I guess it Rockstar Moms asked, that if you want to do your story, just do my story and then your name if you're a YouTuber. I think that's how it was said, and I'm sorry, I told you, you know, it might have been that Palm Spring Cindy or Cindy said it as well. But about beauty. Beauty to me is on the inside. Oh, yes. I try to always have my scalp fixed. I always try to have my hair done. I always try to have lipstick on, which I don't have any lipstick on now. And my makeup is, is worn pretty much off today. <laughs> but I think beauty comes from the inside. When I was growing up, being an identical twin, I was always compared. Always compared. I was compared to if we looked alike, or if our weight was the same, or how do people tell you apart. And being a twin, you are not so much. I was always called, <laughs> this is funny, we were always called those, how are those sweet little twins. We were not beautiful, but we were, I guess you would say, maybe cute. I don't know, because we looked alike. And I don't know. And we wore glasses. I mean, I wore glasses. I mean, I wore glasses. I wore contacts. Finally wore contacts. But if I had any print stuff done or any kind of photography done, I didn't wear my glasses because I didn't want people to see me because I looked like Mrs. Magoo. So, but I, I and then my, my, my smile was off because I smile a little more crooked than my twin did. Um, I had one of my eyes was um, more in, I mean, contacts corrected that, thankfully, or I grew out of it. But I was premature. Faye and I, my twin and I were premature. But I don't know. I always wanted to be pretty. I always wanted to look pretty. I always wanted to have my hair done. I always thought about as I was getting older. Um, I remember the first time I saw some wrinkles. Uh, I was in my, I guess I was maybe um, late 20s, early 30s, and I saw my first, I mean, wrinkle. I said, oh my gosh, I'm getting wrinkled. <laughs> oh, that was nothing. I would take that face over <laughs> any time. I would never, ever, ever, ever. Um, I thought, I'm, why did I complain? I am so lucky to have a face. Oh, I'm not saying that I won't have something done one day. I might, I might have facelifts. I might do that. But I've always been someone, I wanted to have a pretty smile. Because I love, I, you know, I love to smile. I always wanted to have a pretty inside. I want to be, I want to be so pretty on the inside that my outside will make my inside will make up for my outside and as I get older I'm going to go down without a fight for sure because I'm going to keep my makeup on there's very few people that have not seen me with my makeup and I mean if I've been in the hospital or you know people come to see me that sort of thing that that's a given you don't have makeup on and things like that but I really want to be pretty 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 on the inside if you're pretty on the inside, you're going to be pretty on the outside. If you have that smile, you got to be pretty. If you don't have the prettiest smile, that's okay. Just smile anyway. But I remember I was always so critical of myself growing up thinking, oh, I wish I was this and I wish I was that or I wish my hair wasn't curly or I wish. So I've given in to all that. With my natural curly hair, when it gets curly, if you see me on there and my bangs need to be cut or whatever, if you just see the prettiness of me on the inside, 
I don't say anything about people that is unkind. I don't try to treat people unkind. Um, if anybody says that I have, I want to know. Because I, I, I want to know who said I said something. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? But the prettiness of me of starting, first of all, I guess when Faye and I were doing twin ads, started doing our twin stuff, twin, uh, because we were identical, we didn't even tell a lot of our people that we knew that we were doing that because, I don't know, it was just like, um, they don't understand. It's just like you do YouTube, you know, and, you, and you, you're a YouTuber. Us YouTubers know. We normally may not even say anything to a family member, or may not even say anything to a to um, uh, a girlfriend or a friend or acquaintance. Or when you see that they're not watching you, or they're not commenting on you, or giving you at a girl or at a boy, you decide, you know, do this for you. And so that's just like with beauty. I'm going to try to look as pretty as I possibly can. I'm going to try to have that pretty smile as I can, and hopefully I'll con continue to have that pretty smile. And I pray, I pray, the bottom line, that I'm pretty on the inside, that it shows on the outside. I hope you guys have a great day and a happy one. Be kind. Be kinder than they are. Love one another. No matter what, love one another. And don't forget to give a smile. If you do, you might get one back. So remember, you are loved. You're special. And don't let anyone say any different. Keep that smile. Until tomorrow. I love you. I mean it.